You know and love him from classics like The Goonies, Rudy, and the Lord of the Rings trilogy. My personal favorite happens to be Encino Man. But now actor and filmmaker Sean Astin is starring in a new film called Mom's Night Out. What's happening with Goonies 2? That's what everybody wants to know. What are we doing? Well, this is what I know. I'm doing my television show, The Strain, for FX in Toronto, and I'm sitting down with the network brass, and my phone rings in my pocket, and it's you calling saying, hey, I just met with the director, and Goonies 2 is happening, so get ready to go to work. That's all I know. So it's probably on you, baby. <laughs> is that true, Corey? Well, it's that's on about you? all I know, too, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, no, it's crazy. You know, uh, Dick made this. I mean, he told me. I called you when Dick told me personally. But then, uh, but then he makes this announcement very kind of haphazardly to TMZ and gets the entire world excited about it and talking about it and then does nothing. And then a month passes and then he makes another announcement that Steven's involved and then does nothing. So, uh, yeah, we're still uh, – he kind of like threw us under the bus a little bit on that. So, no, no, yeah, no, no, no. I, I happen flailing. to know that they're actively uh, trying to secure a writer based on a – uh, a, 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 an outline that they feel really confident about. So I, so Dick, Dick wasn't going off half cocked. It's just this has been a, a 29 year in the making uh, sequel that you've been as passionate and and you know excited about as as anybody. And and I'm sure that when Stephen, who ultimately is the decision maker on this, when he f has felt the magic. And, and Dick and he are in agreement, which I believe will happen, then, then it'll, it'll be a thing. And if, if they want me to be a part of it, uh, I'm sure it will work out. Tom Cruise would definitely be a Goonie. Be a Goonie? Yeah. Shailene? Um, Encino Man. Encino Man? Yeah, there was going to be a sequel at one point where the cave girl comes out. Like, <laughs> they're going to discover a cave girl, so she would definitely be hot and appropriate for that part. And James Franco, also Goonie. I switch. Tom Cruise, Hobbit. James Franco, uh, Goonie. Miley Cyrus, Ashton Kutcher, and Jennifer Lawrence. Wow. I want to go for Elf Human Elf. Elf Human Elf. I'm sorry, I went off the grid there. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Uh, and there, hmm. Yeah, no. Do you want me to do mine? Do you want yeah, me to do mine? sure. Uh, I'm going to actually go Hobbit, Encino Man, Goonie. All right, I buy that. Sold. You'll take that yep, one? Yep, yep. Okay, yep, last, yep. Last, last, last three. We have Sean Penn, Mariska Hargitay, and George Takai. Let's pull those up. You're, you're making this really hard. Yeah. You're not picking not like photos, Russell Crowe, who's... You know what was so interesting? When we were planning this, someone had asked that we have Russell Crowe, and I yeah, forgot to put it Yeah, because that's in. Hobbit straight away. <laughs> Sorry. No. Uh, uh, let's see. Sean Penn. Uh, let's go with Encino Man for Sean Penn. <laughs> A totally unlikely pull from the uh, bottom of the deck on that one. Uh, Takai. Um, huh. I'd have to say... I'd have to say Hobbit. I mean, look at that smile. He's, at, he's, he's in Middle Earth right now. He's oh, wow. in, He smoked some of the long bottom leaf, and he's now comfortably situated right there at three back shot row. Yeah. <laughs> That's Lord of the Rings Esoteria. He, he doesn't get it. He's no. watching Encino Man. But. I know. And my resolution happened to be that I was making out with Brooke Shields, who's a prominent character in the film. And so we start to make out. It was super intense. And the film rolled out. And we had to do another take. <laughs> 